Hi, this is Jan with Jan's Jewelry Supplies. Today we're going to be making this soldered rhinestone ring. This will be kit 108 on our website. Okay, I have all of my pieces laid out. I'm going to set them aside and then begin rolling out some Play-Doh. And I will have a uh, supply list at the end of the video along with uh, kits and a few different colors available on the website. Just going to roll out the Play-Doh and get a nice smooth surface and begin laying out my pieces. Okay, I'm going to begin laying out my pieces. I like to start in the center and work my way around. I'm just going to go ahead and lay out all of the pieces and then we'll begin soldering. Now that I have all of my pieces laid out, I'm going to begin soldering. I'm using a 300 degree solder with a rosin core and a heat gun. And again, I like to start in the center. It takes about 30 seconds for the piece to heat up enough to melt the solder. And basically you're just kind of drawing a line in between each piece. You want a connection everywhere that you you possibly can get a connection. Um, any piece that is touching or close to touching, you need to make sure you lay down some solder there. Now that I have the top of the ring soldered, I am going to begin laying down some solder on the center stone. This is where the ring will go. I'm just going to lay down some solder. That way when I put the ring in place and reheat it, it will adhere to the top of the ring. Okay, now that I've laid down my solder, I am going to place my ring over the stone that I just added solder to. And I just want to make sure that I center the ring. So I'm just going to center it on that stone. And I'm going to use some pliers to hold it in place while I'm heating it up. And you should be able to see the solder flow once it gets hot enough. And here we have our finished ring completed. It measures about four inches. That is it for this video. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.